wakazi wa kaunti ya Kilifi bado wanakabiliwa na tatizo la nguvu za umeme haswa katika sehemu za vijijini. Viongozi wa eneo hilo sasa wanaitaka serikali ya kaunti na ile ya serikali kuu kuhakikisha kwamba wakazi wanapata umeme ili waweze kufanya miradi ya maendeleo. Mwanahabari wetu Zomolo Wanje anatuarifu zaidi. Ndio hali ambayo makumba wakazi wa kwa Mumba kule wadi ya watama ambapo maisha hapa yamesalia nyuma mithili ya koti kisa na maana ukosefu wa umeme sijapata moto kwangu siwezi kusema nimepata moto sijapata kwetu kabisa hatujapata moto kwetu leni yetu haiyaingia moto siwezi kusema nimepata na sijapata sijapata kwangu moto kitu ambacho ni kama kilio chetu kikubwa ni kuhusu hiyo stima tutafurahi sana kila mwananchi ama kila mwana kijiji akipata hiyo stima maana yake itakuwa ime create job opportunities kwa hiyo kwa si vijana wengi wa kazi hapa wanaliangoa kutokana na kiza pomoni na kuitaka serikali kuwekeza zaidi katika sekta ya kawi nchini ndipo wapate umeme ningependa serikali ya kitaifa iongeze pesa ili sisi wananchi huko mashinani pia nisifaidike kuhusu mradi wa stima. Kauli ya wanakijiji hawa inajiri baada ya wanakijiji shirini pekee kupokea umeme katika eneo zima la kwa Mumba tangu uhuru kujiri Kenya kama anavyofichwa shaibu huyu na mkewe. Muda mrefu tumejitawala mnakwambia nimepiga kura mwaka wa 63 kijiwe Tanga ndio ilikuwa kituo. <laughs> na mpaka leo ndio moto tunaupata. Na mshukuru Mungu zaidi na zaidi. Mimi yangu ni shukurani kumtolea Mungu kwa kupata moto. Kwa hivyo nashukuru. Nimekuwa nayopeleka kwa majirani kupeleka simu madukani. Lakini hivi ah basi. Kulingana na mbunge wa eneo hilo Owen Baya, jumla ya familia elfu tatu hazijapata umeme jambo ambalo limeathiri uchumi na maendeleo kwa sasa. Area hii ya Watamu Ward, Watamu Ward we have over 3000 customers ambao hawana moto. Na those are families, not households. Over 3000 families ambazo hazina moto. And this is Watamu which looks urban. Okay? Ambao sasa mimi nimefanya application kule kuhakikisha kwamba we cover at least half those people the, this financial year. Lakini nilipoenda pale nikaambiwa kwamba hakuna pesa ya kuweka hii moto. So many more people are off the grid. And uh, I want to tell government that they have a responsibility not just build huge roads in Nairobi and other places and get a lot of money wanatengeneza mabarabara makubwa huko ambao watu kidogo wanapitia na watu wa sehemu moja wanapitia na huku kwetu bado watu wanaishi katika giza kuka giza our education standards will still go down access to many things even information will not be there power is of utmost importance and i think national government needs to put more money at the cost to connect people to the grid anadai kuwa takriban 40% ya wakazi wa kaunti ya Kilifi wangali gizani zaidi ya miaka 50 sasa tangu uhuru wa taifa hivi vijiji vyetu hapa havijakuwa na moto toka independence sasa hii ndio Kilifi tunaanza kupata moto na tumepatia priority the rural areas ili tuzifungue lakini kama wanavyojua Kilifi Kilifi has a problem of power coverage for now kwamba kilifi karibu kaunti nzima bado iko chini i think below 45% coverage na hii inaathiri sana maisha yetu sisi kama watu wa, wa kilifi na hawa watu wa Kenya Power pia wakija wakileta moto wanazembea hii project imechukua one year to accomplish kwa sababu ya kuzembea pia we have some issues with community but mimi naona kwamba If this government is serious about the promises they have made to the people to increase connection they have to start at the cost to ensure that we have power. Kutoka kaunti ya Kilifi nikiripoti ya Runinga Citizen langu jina ni Zomolo Wanje.